Hello everyone, welcome to Marg ERP video. Are you a retailer and want to simplify your order process to get rid of manual hassles? So, Marg ERP's ERP to ERP order feature is going to be very beneficial for you. Now, you don't have to waste time viewing orders on software and placing them through the app. Because now you can directly place orders with your distributors through the software itself. With the help of the reorder generated in the software, you can place orders with your distributors and get rid of the hassle of manual ordering. Along with it, by tracking your distributor's livestock in the software, you can avoid losses caused due to shortages. You can apply filters and compare which distributor is offering what kind of offers or schemes for various items. And identify which distributor is providing you with the same items at lower prices as compared to others. Moreover, you also get the facility of substitute products here, as it displays you the related products with the same salt and composition for the item for which you are placing the order. You can also compare the rates and schemes with the help of substitute products and avail the best deals from your distributors. So let's come and see how you can order from ERP to ERP to your distributors and avail these benefits to grow your business. Please note that in order to use this option, it is mandatory for you and your distributors to be active on Retail.io. After registration, you need to map your distributor with the distributors of Retail.io so that you can easily place orders with them, for which we will go to the Transactions menu and click on the ERP to ERP order option. Then the ERP to ERP ordering dashboard window will appear. In this window, the software will show you all your recommended products that you have frequently purchased through the app. Now. Firstly, we will map the distributors, for which we will click on the distributor mapping button given here. So, in this way, the list of all the distributors will be displayed on the screen which you have created in your Mark software, in which, in the distributor name in Mark column, the distributor list will be shown with the name that you have saved in the distributor ledger in your Mark software. Now, to map the distributor that we want, we will click on the distributor name in Retail I.O. field given next to that distributor. Then a pop-up window will open. From here, you will search the distributor and select them. After selecting, we will click on the map button given here. In this way, a message of mapping request sent successfully will be shown and your request will be sent to the distributor. Click on the done button given here. As soon as the distributor accepts your request, you will be able to place orders with that distributor and along with it, you will receive a party code from Retail.io which will be shown in the distributor's party code column. So, in this way, you will map distributors one by one. After that, let's understand the dashboard and know how you can place orders to your distributors. Here, two filters are provided to you. Like, with the filter by distributor, you can apply filter and select distributors as per your requirement. This provides you with the facility to search for products specifically related to the filtered distributors. Similarly, the next tab is filter by manufacturer. You can also filter manufacturers just like the distributors. Now, we will place an order. For which, if you want to order from the recommended products shown here. So you will mention the order quantity in the add quantity field given next to that product and simply click on the plus sign. So, in this way, the product will be added to the cart. And if you want to view the details of that product, then you will click on the arrow key given here. So, you can see the available stock of selected products with the distributor and whether the distributor is offering any scheme or offer. And from here, you can also compare that which distributor is providing you the best rate and scheme. Along with this, you can also view the substitute products. This means that the product which you have selected, the software will show you other products with the same salt and composition. You can compare the rates and schemes from the substitute products and add them to the cart. Next is variant. This means if you search for a product, for example, Ultrasate, and if the distributor has different variants available for that item, like one Ultrasate strip may contain 10 tablets, while another may contain 15 tablets. So, you can compare the items on the basis of their variants and add them to the cart as well. And if you want to order a product other than the recommended products, then in the search bar, you can mention the name of your product and click on the search button. Suppose we search for Crosin. Then in this way, the list of distributors dealing with the Crosin product will appear. By comparing 
which distributor is offering you with the best rate and scheme. You will mention the quantity in the add quantity field given next to that distributor and then click on the plus sign to add the items to the cart. Apart from this, if you want to place an order on sale basis, means which items are there in your stock that have high demand in the market and you want to place order on that basis. So this facility is also provided to you in this feature. You can do this with the help of the reorder management option in Mark software. Basically, with the help of reorder management, the items generated on the sale basis will be loaded on the ERP to ERP order window in just a few clicks. From there, you can view those items and place orders through a single window. And you don't have to repeatedly check an order through the diary or Excel and waste your time. For this, you will go to the daily reports menu and then from daily working, you will click on the reorder management option. So, you will switch to the reorder on sales basis window in which the software has set a default reorder formula based on your sales. Now, if you want to place your order based on this formula, you will click on the ERP to ERP button given here. This will redirect you to the ERP to ERP ordering window. Similarly, if you want to review or modify the items generated in the reorder process according to this formula, then you will click on the generate button given here. So in this way, software will generate a reorder based on a specific formula. Here, we want to explain that if the retail IO code is mentioned in both that is in the item master and in party ledger master, then those items will be directly added to your cart. And if the retail I.O. code is not active in any item or party ledger, then those items will be displayed on the right side of the ERP to ERP order window. Now, let's press the escape key. Then from this save window, we will click on the ERP to ERP order field. So, you will see that the items with the mentioned code are automatically added to the cart. And the items without the retail I.O code will be shown in the cart item list. Now, if you also want to place an order for these items, you can search for each item one by one using the search bar given here and add them to the cart. Otherwise, you can simply place the order for the loaded items in the cart by clicking on the place order button. Once you place the order, then a message of order successfully placed will be shown to you. Simply click on OK. As soon as you place the order, the Marg ERP software will automatically generate your purchase order. After placing the order, if you want to check its status, then you will click on the order status tab given here. From here, you can track the orders which you will place to your distributors. For example, from the drop down of select distributor field, you will select a particular distributor to check the status of order given to that particular distributor or select all if you want to view the status of orders given to all the distributors. Similarly, the order status drop-down provides different status, such as pending, placed, failed, etc. You can select that order which you want to track as per your requirement, or can also select the field as all. Apart from this, you can also set a date range to view the status of your orders. In this way, you can apply filters. Now, from here, you will click on the search button. So, you can view the status of your orders on the basis of the filters applied. In addition to this, the dashboard also provides you with some shortcut keys. For example, if you press Alt plus T key, then the distributor filter window will open. Similarly, with the help of Alt plus N key, you can filter the manufacturers. With the help of Alt plus C key, you can directly switch to the cart window. And by using Alt plus S key, you can directly switch to the product search bar. So, in this way, you can use the ERP to ERP order option of Marg ERP software and can simplify your ordering process. Thanks for watching.